Assalamu alaikum beautiful people hope you guys are doing well having a great time um, today we are here with another exciting opportunity it's a summer camp and it's called UM camp uh, UMI camp 2020 and it's uh, in Indonesia it's a partially funded opportunity but it is still a great opportunity as it doesn't has any application fees and it doesn't needs any islets or TOEFL so before starting this video I will not say that subscribe to my channel and do this and that you will do that on your own if you want to and so I just want to give you some some tips guys um, yesterday night I was like uh, um, listening to some of the things and reading most of your comments and getting to know well what problems and what things are you facing right now as you guys like go and on and on and apply to different things and you come up with failure and you think like uh, what will you do now what are good what will you do next and like uh, i am failed and i don't want to apply again so these are the things i was reading yesterday night my dear friends i just want to tell you one thing that uh, when whenever you are applying to anything or whenever you are trying to achieve anything you have to be ready to be to be called a failure like if you think you will 100% succeed then you are I believe you're stupid if you are willing that I will come up with failure I will come up with failure and I will fight this failure until I get succeeded then trust me you will be succeeded one day but if you don't and you just uh, come up with that uh, oh my god I have just uh, failed and I'm not going to try again there are a lot of competition you have to compete in that competition and you have to tell your failure that come on I'm here and I will make you down I, I'm not going to be defeated I will defeat you I will defeat my failure so just trust on yourself try try and try again until you get it I am doing this I have just traveled to two or three countries that's all I haven't traveled to the world I haven't traveled to Saudi Arabia I haven't traveled to Turkey I haven't traveled to Germany I haven't traveled to uh, England I haven't traveled to whatever this country was Iran USA I haven't traveled to these countries but a, a friend of mine has traveled to this country as you can see our first success story so for example, you tried to hundred of uh, like uh, you tried to hundred uh, applications. You filled hundred applications. You go on and on, and uh, you failed on that hundred applications. And you get succeeded on the another, which is called in the numbers one zero one application. You succeeded. What do you think? What will you? What will I call you? Obviously, you succeeded. You are a successful person. You did it. But this is not only about these applications, this is all about your life, this is all about your passion, what exactly do you want, what do you want to do, what do you want to study, what do you want to, like how do you want to earn in your life, these are all the things related to each other. But just remember one thing, when you failed 100 times, you haven't failed 100 times, you have learned 100 ways of failure. And these 100 ways of failure will help you in the future that how you can be more and more successful with these lessons, with these 100 failures. So just trust on yourself, trust on God and do the best as you can. And fight, fight until your last breath. It is not about these scholarships, it's not about these opportunities, it's about you and it's about your life, it's about your passion, it's about what you really want to do. So, let's just uh, start today's video and uh, UMIC camp, summer camp program in Indonesia. And I do apply on some of the programs and I don't, I, I even do if I'm eligible to some of the programs, I don't like the programs, I don't apply to those programs and some of them select me, some of them reject me but still go on and on and on and on and fight 
So the host country is Indonesia. Program duration is 14 days and the program dates is 16th July to 29th of July 2020 to introduce Indonesian culture, especially Malang. Okay, this is from objectives from 1 to 10. You can read it on your own. And uh, the program benefits are no application fees, no eyelids required, settlement, meals, snacks, each and everything except your travel and flight tickets. Students are to cover their uh, own travel flight tickets, insurance, immigration documents and any personal needs. Letter of support is provided in case to find support from other institutions or parties amount request. Eligibility criteria be at least 18 years of age by the start of the program, be enrolled in a higher education institution, have successful completed at least one semester of college or university course. This is a summer program but they are kind of uh, uh, giving the eligibility requirements some sort of like internship like uh, come on are you joking I successfully completed at least one semester like for a summer program it is not necessary that you should be a student or not. So, but uh, for them you should be an initial student of your college or university with the initial semesters if you want to participate in this summer program. Okay, how to apply? These are the documents you will need. Personal statement, motivational letter, formal photo, scan of passport, medical certificate, uh, declaration of la letter, and uh, that's it. So they haven't given any kind of like... Uh, a format for uh, medical certificate or uh, they did have uh, only for medical certificate they didn't have any uh, given uh, uh, format so you can come up with any of a medical certificate with any of the local doctor or hospital so follow the instruction given you can wait for notification this is the result this is the timeline of the application this is the deadline of the application if you want to apply just click on this red button you will come up with this page you don't have an account just click on this enter your email email password whatever and that's it uh, so you will come up with another um, like uh, email and which will call the confirmation email and after confirming your account just log in and when you log in the application process is very much simpler you just need to cl click on let's get started and these are the things which we uh, which i have already defined and this is the um, declaration form we will get to this form later on first of all let's start with section one uh, section one requires your personal details full name and th these are the things you can add on your own phone number, mobile number, whatsapp, date of birth, gender, martial status, religion, passport, expiry date, nationality. Okay. Section 2. Um, bachelor, Master, PhD. Mm, these are okay. Let's go to section 3. Um, obviously, if you're a Muslim, you just need to click on this. Lal and do you have any disability if you have any disability please specify here okay personal statements okay so what is personal statement how to write a personal statement these are the things they have already like uh, distributed the personal statement in different categories like answer each of these questions one by one and overall your personal statement is completed please tell us your motivation for applying why you are applying why you are so interested uh, why they will choose you on the other guy who is applying good 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 question to answer and uh, how this uh, form and how this how, how the theme of the form is related to your professional work your professional career your uh, work experience your volunteer experience so these are the things you are supposed to uh, relate to each other and come up with a story which story defines you and give another body some kind of inspiration so that he might be interested to talking to you in the, in a further future please share volunteer or extracurricular experience in your school community so obviously if you are watching this video i believe you have a volunteer work or extracurricular activity so your achievement traits uniqueness specialties why we need to choose you as a participant what is your plan after um participating in this program and how did you hear about umi so that's it that's almost done so section five 
section 5 will be emergency contact details, full name, relationship, email. Whenever I apply to something like that, I apply, I just give the name of uh, my mother, the phone number of my mother in the emergency contact. So that that is the only person in the whole world which I believe should be notified at first. <coughs> like she's a really... <coughs> Um, <clears throat> I'm sorry about that. Okay, so passport size photo, scan of passport, medical certificate. I told you you can like uh, um, <clears throat> upload any medical certificate from any local hospital or something like that. When you click on example, so this is the example of the passport size photo they want you to upload and uh, this is the declaration form they want you to upload. This is how they want you to upload. <clears throat> so this was the same form which I already opened previously and I told you that I will explain it later on so this is the form you have to declare that each and everything is correct and you will follow each and every rules and laws of Indonesia and you will be trying to be a good uh, visitor and go back to your home after this and that so after doing that print the form complete the form by hand or if you want to complete the form by uh, like uh, Adobe Acrobat or whatever, you can do that as well. But you, you, they are not accepting electronic signature. This is what I want you to understand. So after uploading this, uh, these all these things. <clears throat> your section 6 from information till section 6 will be completed this smiley will be turned into this happy this sad person will turn into a happy person all these one by one and this confirmation will be automatically ticked ok after completing all these sections you will go to the confirmation and you will just see a button that uh, says uh, submission or submit the form whatever just need to submit the form and after clicking that button your application will be completed your application will be submitted without any application fees charges or whatever so that's it that's it from today and one another thing i want you to tell is uh, be consistent be consistent in what you want to achieve be the stubborn person who is ready to fail the failure to to face the failure until until success will come up be the stubborn person whatever you want to do whatever you want to achieve in your life just be that stubborn person most of them even all of them will say what are you doing you cannot do that you cannot do that your relatives your relatives your friends and everyone but you have to trust yourself set targets set goals daily goals each and every day that i will do this i will do that and slowly and gradually you will come up with results my friends have a good day if you guys have still have something to ask you can comment me you can comment uh, in the comment sections and let me know i will get back to you as soon as possible thank you so much for watching guys i love you all i love you all i, li I really do and i really want you guys to succeed thank you so much bye bye